Test. Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. My name is Grayson. I hope everybody's doing well. Today is Thursday. Here is our new soft washing truck. So I ended up finding a 2015 F-150 for right around $30,000. It was cheaper than a 2008 Duramax that I found, so instead of getting a diesel, um, I ended up going with just a gas truck. It has a six and a half foot bed, so it'll fit my soft wash skid that I'm going to be picking up perfectly. It's a Lariat, fully loaded, has running boards, leather interior, heated, cooled seats, center console, full back seat as well. So great truck, has 90,000 or 91,000 miles on it. But it's gonna be perfect for what we need. So I'm gonna be driving it to Alabama in like 10 weeks and picking up a soft wash skid that'll go in the back and then it will have an aluminum ladder rack built onto the skid as well. Have my logos on there for now until we get the entire truck wrapped but I love this red color, so I actually don't know. I might keep the logos on and just put some uh, decals on it for now. So that's gonna be our soft wash truck. And then we have this, that will be the estimate vehicle, unless I sell it. I might sell it. I've been driving the truck today for estimates and it is so much, it's, it's so much more comfortable to drive than the WRX. So I might be selling it and switching it up and buying a second F-150. But the interior of this thing is basically the exact same as my F-350 I had, but this truck is $25,000 cheaper. So I had another employee start on Monday and I have two more starting next week. We are getting busy. Um, today is April 1st, so I'm planning out the rest of quarter two. Uh, quarter one, we only did about $82,000, but that was a 13% increase over quarter one of 2020. So not too bad at all. Uh, we definitely are improving year over year. And then quarter two, our goal is $300,000 which we'll have to hit about $4,600 per day to hit that. And right now I only have capacity to, capacity to do about $215,000 for quarter two. So I have to hire a few more guys um, in order to get up to that point. But been doing a lot of estimates and scheduling a lot of jobs as well. It's been going good with that. So mainly as we hire I'm gonna get my seatbelt on really quick, just a second. So as we're hiring more guys, I'm finding that I don't have the equipment I need. Um, I'm having to try to buy and keep up with equipment and hiring. So I have a huge order of window cleaning equipment coming in soon. And then I need to get this truck fully equipped and ladders and everything for this one as well. Um, to put a crew into But we have we're about a week out right now with work as well So that's the perfect amount that I want to be booked out I don't want to go over that week amount because then we're not able to serve our customers well And I just feel like people don't want to wait more than a week to get the work done. So we're about a week out um, Haven't started our Google Ads yet so once Google Ads start, if we didn't hire anybody else, I think we'll probably get to about four to five weeks out, especially going into spring. So hiring four more guys in the next two weeks and starting Google Ads, it should balance out to where we're not gonna be booked out four weeks. <laughs> but. Hey guys, so sorry that I didn't post on Sunday. I've been extremely busy. Uh, I was up till about midnight trying to get our towels all washed. The washer broke, so I had to wash them by hand and put them in the dryer. And then uh, had to finish up payroll before Monday. 
but today's Tuesday. I'll be posting my video and then I'll keep posting uh, every Sunday. Hopefully everything goes according to plan. But thanks for watching the video and I will see you guys next time.